fun ride. Got the adrenaline pumping a little bit. It's been a while. Guys, it's starting again where people are absolute idiots when they get to the airport. Uh, yes, yes. It is Friday, so that makes sense, but a bunch of people who don't know how to travel and just walk out of the front door, stop in the middle of the sidewalk. It's the part of uh, traveling that I did not miss during COVID. You guys know how I love to walk up to the gate and walk right onto the plane, and that's just what happened. I love it. No waiting, no sitting around, no twiddling my thumbs. Just right onto the plane, babe. What a cool dude. He's got a house in Kona. He was a firefighter for like 25 years, telling me stories about rescuing people. I always love meeting people like that on the road and just hearing their crazy stories. It's kind of part of life experience, even though you can't experience it yourself. Out of all of the lists I've made on Instagram, oh my god, as I was saying before, so fing rudely interrupted, is I'm off keto and I got some treats. Boarding first class as well? Okay, here we go. Just what I love. What do you love? An empty plane. flight was insane. The two parents that were in front of me in first class, from the time they sat down, they were screaming like at the top of their lungs. I just don't understand. The entire flight was victimized by that. I'm back at the Hyatt Houston Galleria. This is my second time here. The last time I was here on the Houston shoot from December, I stayed at this hotel. Just so you guys know, I aspire to make every single person contribute to my f***ery. <laughs> Tonight I finally, after like 17 trips, got Trissa to contribute to my f***ery. Oh my god. Oh, I like this one. Trying to go get some food. Um, it's a little bit late. I uh, hit my room and I took a little nap. Uh, see if we can get into something. Uh, I'm not sure if we can, but let's try. Let's give it a good Houston effort. Oh, look who it is. Look who it be. Our new motto, you get what you get. Put your bag right there. Look, there's a little spot right here for it. All right. Here we go. I tend to not want to go to like chain type restaurants and they have one of these in every major city, but we are hungry. We do need to eat some food and we have a hella early call time tomorrow. Uh, I just ate a f ton of bread, which I feel glorious because that's the first time I've done that in 40 days, 40 days and 40 nights. And, and this weekend's Easter, so it, it's very fitting. Uh, but check this out. First, um, alcoholic beverage. Here's the 40 days and 40. Get your wine over here, babe. Sorry. Last time I uh, was in Omaha. Omaha was the last time we had drink. Cheers. So we have a we have a woman here. She's fucking schmammed. Debatable whether she's going to make it out the front door. Oh, and they're mixing her another one. They're mixing her another. I mean, God forbid it, I should tell anybody how to live their life. So go to dinner at Capital Girl and get smashed as fuck. 
Now nah, she's talking about my camera. Is she? Is yeah. She, she said this guy's camera. Well, she can well, see. Super she can see. She. What's that? <laughs> Welcome to Houston. What do you think about this? I mean, this is not bad. I, I'm not gonna lie. Last time we talked, Uber rating, 4.94, it went down. It was that dude. Which guy? The, the, the guy, the Iranian guy. Our Uber driver started out being a dick at first. I wanted to give him two stars, but you know what? I saw that he was gonna flip that shit on us and give us two stars. Guess what, five stars all around. What's your uh, passenger rating on Uber? 4.94. Are you, you're telling me that the Iranian guy on the Bella V, the Indiana vlog, rated us lower than five stars? He definitely gave me, gave, gave us three or four stars. My, my rating went down to four, 4.90. Ooh, it's kind of... Mm, my first dessert, please kill. Mm, really fucking nice. I thoroughly enjoyed my first dessert after keto. It was glorious. Well, we're closing this bitch down. See you guys in the morning. Good morning, friends. It's the butt crack of dawn. We're at our good old Starbucks and Gallery of Houston. We're about to be on our way to our shoot. Love getting up at the butt crack of dawn. So it's 716 and uh, as you can see behind me, the only people here in this parking lot are me and Rob. Let's just go back to LA, who cares? Let's go visit Trista. All right, guys, that's a wrap on the outside locations. We're going back to the office to do some procedurals. Got to uh, witness uh, a really staged proposal. I totally thought it was gonna be a surprise, and she was not surprised at all, and I was like, oh, this is lame. She didn't even cry. Yeah. And yes. they didn't even kiss. They didn't even kiss. When she, when she said yes, he was like, oh, and he got up and hugged his mom, and I'm like, okay, that was fake. That was right. Yeah. It was so strange. Oh my God, they even tried. He didn't try. <laughs> Cheers, Doc. Cheers. Thanks for the coffee. Oh, that's fucking great. Boom tizzy, <laughs> kizzy, in H tizzy. <laughs> Well, that's a wrap on the shoot for Saturday. They're trying to go get drinks tonight. I don't know if I'm gonna join. Just found out my flight tomorrow night is canceled. What, what, are, what are we doing exactly? Why, why are we canceling my flight less than 24 hours before the actual flight? So apparently I'm gonna have to get up at 5 a.m. Cause who doesn't love getting up at 5 a.m. on a Monday? I, I don't, I don't like getting up at 5 a.m. There's so many possibilities of what we may be doing tonight or what we may not be doing tonight. It's seven o'clock and we're just getting back to the hotel. Uh, so we had basically a 12 hour day and uh, I need to rejuvenate before we decide what we're gonna do. No matter what you say, what you do. When I'm alone, I'd rather be with you. Fuck these other niggas, I'll be right by your side till 2005. Oh, oh. No matter what you say, what you do. When I'm alone, I'd rather be with you. Fuck these other niggas, I'll be right by your side. Here we are. Papa's brothers. What's up, my bro? We're going to the restaurant. Let's get, let's grab a cocktail. Let's grab a cocktail. Cocktail hour, sir. How you doing, sir? Oh yes. Nice to you. 
Oh, yes. Let me rock my feminine ass martini glass and not give a fuck. Can I get a kiss teeny? <laughs> I don't normally have a thirst Beautiful. for alcohol. But for some reason, since post-keto, I have this crazy thirst for it. I just, I don't know. Cheers to all you motherfuckers. Cheers to these two guys for a successful shoot today. Hey, to you guys. Taking it easy. Thanks, Fossil and Rob. Thank you. Thank you. Little smorgasbord here, huh? What do you think? What do you think? What do you think? What do you think? Yeah? Motobene? Si. Motobene. Oysters here. They bring you vinegar? Like they do ketchup. It's insane. It's insane. Like they put it on their fries. Hermanos Arroyo. That is good. Food. There we go. That's what we're talking about. Which one's filet? And this one. There it is. Tuvimos una noche fabulosa en la cena de hoy. Comimos mucho, mucho steak, mucha carne, mucha carne, sí, mucha carne y unos postres espectaculares. Sí, sí. Okay, so. Gracias por todo. Seguro, no. Déjame salir. Mucho, a... mucho gusto. It's pretty, baby. Good dinner with the clients tonight, guys. Uh, we had a great time. Really good conversation. Really good meet. Some beautiful cars out here with the clients and um, some new friends. I've been here like probably 16 or 18 times. I've always had sort of a aversion to this place because it always seems like a fake city. But I will tell you, when you meet some people who are attuned to the substance, you get a little bit of the substance and it's actually worth experiencing. I had Wagyu for the first time, which was bananas. I'd never tasted Wagyu steak. I've had a million filet mignons and that was crazy. We had some really good um, dessert. Where I'm coming, I'm talking to the people here. Babe, I don't know why when I drink a little bit, I had like two drinks and like two glasses of wine. I'm like flowy as fuck on the vlog. I just let it happen. Yeah, that's the way it is, bro. I just, but I, and I say shit that makes sense. <laughs> and it's it's just good. It's just, I fucking slur a little bit too much. <laughs> Anyways, <laughs> hey. Why do I feel like I'm going so fast? What are you going to I will have a um, grande latte. Anything else? That's all. Can I get your name? Well, better than yesterday. Happy Easter, friends. Uh, Rob Filios and Fazilla coming to you from Starbucks at too early as fuck in the morning on Easter. It's we like 8 30. Still too early as fuck, bro. We're heading to the shoot. Should be a real easy day. Three hours later. Location two. Here we go. We are going to go fast. Corner so fast, bro. <laughs> Rob's got some talent. Can't lose this guy. You caught up 
to us real fast. Uh, he's, uh, I'm trying. He's got some skills. I don't know where you're going. I gotta catch up. <laughs> <laughs> I can't focus on what needs to get done. I'm on notice, open that shit or run. So we wrapped the first outside location on the dock. We're gonna go grab some lunch really quick. We're gonna go to location two and three and then we're gonna wrap the shoot. But that's not what I wanna do. You like it? And I'm not shooting on Easter to make fun of you. Seems like All right, guys, so that's a wrap on the shoot. We're going to drop everybody off and then uh, maybe get some coffee. The day's still young, who knows? Thanks for everything. It's fun. Yeah, well done. Thanks for the ride in the car. Stay safe. What are we, uh, what are we doing, Ben? Guess who's on the vlog again? Repeat customer. So happy to have you. So happy to see you. You look great, by the way. Shepherd, right? Towards Washington. I got you, I got you, I got you. Cheyenne and Gibran. Say what's up, everybody. We were in there for 20 minutes and I swear it seems like it was like four hours and I have no idea where we're going. Why is she a little drama queen? That's what happens when you're half ease. Half ease. Yes. Half ease. I don't. You're so cute. Stop it. Tristan uh, Queso, ASAP Rocky, she says. Anyways, I'm over here at the taco spot, getting some horchata, getting some tacos, and keep some Texas, man. This shit's crazy out here. Hey, thanks for inviting me. Hell yeah. Your sister's crazy as fuck, but I love it. Anyways. She's not gonna lose her job. Don't even trip. Guys, who said Grace? Did anybody say Grace? Yes. Is it you? Yeah, you want to see it? Yeah, let me see. Okay. I have it right here. In español, por favor. Look. <laughs> <laughs> like, comment, and subscribe to no. this face. All right, guys, that's a wrap on Houston. Um, like, comment, and subscribe on YouTube if you give a fuck. If you don't, then who gives a fuck? Anyways. And please come to Dr. Men's for all your plastic surgery needs. Thanks. Bye. Bye.